point. Uh, as a past officer of the All Party Group on Smoking and Health, I would urge the Government to publish the new tobacco control plan. We've been waiting some 18 months for this now. A great deal was achieved under the previous plan. Progressive tobacco control legislation was introduced. Smoking rates among adults and children have fallen below the target levels and rates of smoking during pregnancy are very nearly below 10%, which is a huge improvement of just a decade ago. And that is why we, Britain is a world leader in tobacco control, with the UK coming top in European survey measuring the implementations of key tobacco control policy and passing legislation that goes further. Yes, I will. The Honourable Gentleman give way, and I don't know if he shares my concern that when the EU tobacco directives included vaping, that, that that improvement that he's now seen may well start tailing off as it's becoming more and more difficult to actually take up vaping and get themselves off cigarettes. Well, uh, could I just say that uh, we've gone far better than what the European directive told us to do. In relation to vaping, my understanding is that the new tobacco control plan will have vaping in it. And National Health uh, uh, National H England have told us that you know it is 95% safer than using uh, uh, cigarettes, uh, uh, and that is a fact. There are some 2.8 million people who smoke. It's not a way to get into cigarettes. Who smoke at the moment who have voluntarily gone on to vaping, which is 95% safer than cigarettes. We need to make sure that that the action plan for tobacco recognises that fact, uh, and, and more will need to be done to support vaping. Uh, and that may be in public places as well, I have to say. I will give way for the last time to my... I speak, um, I declare an interest as a vapour. Um, but isn't it also, not as well as it um, being healthier and safer, isn't it an issue of social justice as well? Because it is far, far cheaper to vape than it is to buy cigarettes. And as we know, poorer people are most likely to smoke. Yes, indeed it is, and I have to say, some people who say that they don't like vaping because some of it is owned by tobacco companies are wholly wrong. I've had a running battle with tobacco companies for decades in this place now, and they are wholly wrong to use uh, attitudes to, to vaping in, in that way. Could I move on very quickly? Uh, well, very quickly, go on. Mr Speaker, I just wondered if the right honourable gentleman was aware that, of course, the European Tobacco Products Directive introducing, make it more difficult for vapours, was introduced by a British Labour member of the European uh, Parliament and the Conservatives in the European Parliament at the time made exactly this point that it would restrict vaping. I, I am very aware of it. I'm also very aware that vaping is good for public health and I support it. Could I uh, move on very quickly now?